so... Caitlyn's always loved camping. And I have always, like, done backpacking, but not been that enthusiastic about it in the past. And Caitlyn had actually never backpacked before. In America... Roger that, big sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current oh, enemy status at the up. site is unknown. Stop talking. In, in America, camping is when you, like, drive to a campground and then either pitch a tent next to your car or just sleep, like, in a trailer with your car or something. And backpacking is when you put the stuff on your back and walk around. That was weird to me, because growing up in New Zealand, okay. um, camping is when you carry around a bag on your back. Anyway, on move. Um, so I got to like teach her what backpacking was, and she got to be enthusiastic about it, and it worked out pretty well. Sort of all added up together. I lost any soldiers this campaign. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The memorial command automatically pulls the names of the fallen from the save file. We've had some losses, but not many recently. It's really not where Van Dorn should be. On this large landed map, ooh, we have an ethereal here. On this large landed map, we don't have a motion tracker. We don't have a I'm an arc thrower. There you go. That's a large pod. Wow. On this large landed, the command pod's over here. So we're trying to go this way. Carefully. We were trying not to die. We'll see how that works out. This might be a reasonable time to use a ghost grenade. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Threat of bears. There are active bears in the Olympics. I mean, they're not really threatening. They just want to eat berries and chill out. Um, if you are on a trail with blind corners or whatever, you'll want to blow a whistle as you're walking around so that they don't get frightened by you. Firing rocket. And if you see one approaching you, you probably want to like leave your food and walk away. But in general, the, the bears are pretty chill. Where I was camping, okay. there was not much risk of contact with bears. We were out on the coast. And the bears are more active in the mountains. So who actually sees either of those? Headed there now. Jeez. Need a command for all the variations on slight mistakes. I was thinking about making a command which scanned my chat for someone saying slight mistake and then like kept track and performed analysis on like how far apart the slight mistakes were and how many had happened so far today and things like that. The the constant struggle with a command like that is that it takes time for me to write it and I would rather just play the game or do the work that I have to do. So 
We don't want the Marauder. Too close by because we don't want Overwatch to go off. Terrible name can like step up here or something. It's fine. It's not the bomb with you. Fly a sniper. That's the turn. We can get out next turn, I think. Or at least we can move toward getting out. If this turn looks really nasty. never liked this part of this map. It's just an awkward cover piece to fight around. Looks like they are clustered up. Now. Don't know where the ethereal is. Heading there now. But these guys are definitely clustered. All right. No vision for Van Dorn is pretty shitty. No vision for most people, really. Probably didn't need the ghost grenade. Let's try to bring down the mechdoids this turn. Maybe I'll disabling shot one of the mutant elites. Kill this mutant elite, hopefully, as well. Yeah, even my Valkyrie can't shoot twice. That's just not great. Huh. Seems not great. Seems, seems not great here. Yeah, yeah, I did avoid the acid. I noticed that. Gunbluster has very low aim. Please die, please die, please die, please. Oh. Uh. <laughs> why? Oh, why did they do this to me? They just have to make it interesting. Four percent with heat ammo. I could hollow. I don't think I'm using command this turn. I hope not. Because like it's on a soldier who's used all of their actions now, so it's not happening either way. We do have heat ammo here. Okay. Shit. So we've completed mechoid autopsy, which means 10. I think we can slip back out of the overwatch as well. Don't really want the Mutant Elites shooting us. There's a Guardian right now. An Engineer, Van Dorn doesn't have actions. Unfortunately, because he's using an LMG. It's a Gauss strike rifle. They're not chemmed. They're not shredded. I could chem them. But if I chem them, I don't get chem on the... It's on elites is the problem. Oh. <sighs> If I take the shot and it doesn't kill, 
I can grenade them, put the guardian like here, shoot the one who isn't dead. It's probably okay. Probably okay. Might be okay. Got him. That was not particularly close to not dying, was it? Let's step back. Will you please? Okay. Okay. I've been uh, I've been giving my soldiers far too little credit, apparently. I'm right here. I also sort of wonder what the ethereal is doing. I'd love to uh, disable you. Can we do that. Mm, no. All right, let's fly the general. A terrible name. Ideally, somewhere where he can see like one or two, but not all. Like here, maybe. That also prevents the ethereal from attacking him as easily, potentially. And Dorn back a little bit more. Light fuel may run out on a mission this long. What you gonna do? Oh, was that the ethereal? It was. All systems remain operational. Solid 32% shot. Shot there. Get me the hell out of here. Breaks the suppression. And a hunker. I don't mind a hunker. All right. Motion tracker would be really nice, wouldn't it? Sort of sneak up here. Looking for the ethereal. Is visible. Is visible here though? I think this move's safe, right? Looks like it's safe. Does it do good things? I don't know if it does good things. Valkyrie can only do that, basically. This move is a lot more exciting than that move. To do the same thing, get a shot at the ethereal. But it's, like, clearly not safe. That's eh. Let's try this one. 59. It can reflect if I miss. If I go with the pistol, it's a 63. It's not really noticeably better. Get the hollow. The 7. Thorn has a 93% twice here. The problem. And actually, I'll take an in the zone kill, I think. Okay. 
on ethereal dead guns dry Number 52% here with hollow targeting Hollow this guy too. Beautiful. He is shredded and camped. Want someone to kill this back muton? Rapid fire is a little bit better than a single shot. I have not captured an ethereal yet, Paloward. No chance on this mission though, there's no uh, arc thrower here. Donalit does not care that he's on fire, that's too bad. <laughs> and... I'm on my way. Huh, I wonder if that chem's running out. Take a reload. Affirmative moving out. Here. It's my turn. That was the second ethereal of the campaign. We did have another one in an earlier transport. That is a pot of floaters. Yes, sir. All right, holy shit, it's a lot of floaters. Doesn't really look like they're clustered enough for suppression to be valuable from Van Dorn. From, Dorn. from Van Dorn. Bringing them down one by one. So if we shred here, still have cover. Rocket here makes the Indizan sniper very, very reliable though. But tandem? Shit, it's not quite... It's not quite doing it for me. Grenade is actually really good. That was a, a bold move forward right there. Okay, missing sucks. This grenade. There ish. That noticeably did not remove one of those guys' cover. Maybe put a shred here. It's like, I don't know. There are a lot of floaters. They're only floaters, though. Feels wrong to be using a bunch of consumables on this pod. Kill. My only hit and run. So the other guys who are landed are for my sniper to kill, I guess. Let's shoot here. Ammo on reserves. These are lethal shots that I'm missing. It sort of sucks to miss them. Okay, seven floaters. That can fail to kill. One, two, three, four. We have five bullets, right? Hostile eliminated. One. Two. 
to It's only a 98. No, that's 100. Three. Okay. I'm rolling. Can also be mind fraying these at this point. Adjusting aim. When you love us. Trying to bring this low enough for in the zone to kill it as well. No. Just put a terrible name here on Overwatch. And just take the skill. I'm almost out. Um yeah, if you give your soldiers damage perks their perks deal a lot of damage. These floaters are probably just running away, I guess. Oh no, he's going for it. Please die. Shit. It's gonna be wound time. Oh, it missed. Okay, I can appreciate that. We'll be using a charge of restorative mist pretty soon, it looks like. Kill you. Guns dry. Up over here. Try to kill you. Specs have not been hitting many shots recently. This probably kills it. Sure. Nothing's moving down there. Well, we turned combat music off. Ready to rock. Fifteen aliens dead. Plenty more to come still. We've been hearing an exalt pod. Haven't been hearing much else. Back in. Because they did use. Do you have Savior yet? Probably. Weapons hot. Grab some reloads. Still only hearing Exalt moving around. Okay, I'm confused by that audio cue. I don't know what that meant. I think that was to the command pod, but I was getting noise from the exalt pod, which is moving as well. Yeah, around about 50. Probably a little bit less than 50, Findle. Overwatch. Overwatching. We have eyes on the target. I just want to This sounds like lots of exalt pods. Okay, I still don't have the best grasp ever of what's going on on this map. We heard some floaters, we've heard plenty of exal, we've heard some footsteps and some flying over this way. Oh, did I hear lids instead of floaters? Maybe I heard lids. This exal pod does have some gene modded dudes. 
So that could be a real thing. I don't think these lids are moving. I think these guys are. On the move. There are some line of sight bugs with the wall here. I wouldn't actually mind if the lids bolt, so I'm not too worried about it. Aye, aye, Commander. You want to be careful around the wall down here when there's a pot in here, though, because sometimes you'll somehow see them. Jet back on deck. Let's do this. Has anyone Don't ever fight. figured out what Exalt is saying? I don't think they're saying anything. Pretty sure they're not saying anything. <laughs> Fuck Comcast. They might be saying fuck Comcast. I'm on the move. Confirmed coordinates. Roger that. If they were saying anything, it would probably be that, given how often Ready their network goes down. Oh, I've dropped another uh, 900 frames. Sorry about that, guys. That sure isn't anything I can do anything about. I could drop my fifth rate. Sounds unfortunate for your run. Headed there now. I'm on the move. Уже иду. Roger, tracking. Oh god. Affirmative. Got it covered. Moving to Overwatch. Come on, friends. Hey, there it is. How's it going? I'm on it, Commander. I'm like salivating right now at the idea of bringing robot death to this exalt pod. Moving. Should I be concerned, like, about my humanity? These are the humans. On it. I'm probably not meant to be this excited about killing them. Maybe I'm just hungry. In motion. I probably shouldn't be hungry for human blood, though. Hmm. Oh, they have melt. It's, it's gotta be what it is. Okay. Roger that. Come get some chem grenade initiate. I was hoping for just a regular Overwatch ambush. Call me old fashioned. Start the bomb. Start the barbecue. All right. Overwatching. We have eyes on the target. Moving to Overwatch. Let you know in the blue tenure. Come get some Overwatch. Hostiles spotted. So they didn't really, like, move forward, which made that not the most exciting thing ever. But now I have, like, all of my actions, and they're standing like that. So yeah, this should be fine. What do we do? Is that worth the rocket? A shred probably gives me, what, five kills with my sniper? Oh, Van Dorn could just shred though. I 
enemy is Didn't do as much as I was hoping it would. Let's go for a shred. It's not doing very much either. Let's go for a regular rocket. Doesn't leave any more regular rockets for this mission. That's probably okay. Let's go for the That made me feel things that I haven't felt in like years. That uh, that excited parts of me that I I didn't know a video game soldier could excite anymore. Taken care of. Those are some very large numbers on that rocket. Adrenaline surge. Oh no. Um, Moving out. Once he used the sniper rifle in this campaign. Nah. I have used zero sniper rifles in this campaign. I think they're just much worse than marksman's rifles. There's a lot of surging going on this mission. Alright, that's some good damage. The only problem is the lids are likely to activate and we don't have a ton of bullets right now. We do have a shredder rocket. Ow. Exalt dealt with. There they are. Three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, God. Muton noises on the map. <laughs> so I guess we can just like walk backwards. It's unclear to me what chrysalids do exactly against flying soldiers. I think nothing. I'm pretty sure nothing. I could warn I <laughs> warn them. I could burn them. It's true. This seems like it deals with the pod without requiring any consumables though. Drinks are on me. Yeah, when it comes down to it, it turns out the chrysalids don't have guns. Which is really too bad for them. Um, whoa, he just got next to me with a move left and then didn't attack. Apparently those are slightly faster than I thought they were. We'll call that a uh, mild misstep. 
So, AoE Shred is good here, but just shooting twice is probably a little bit better. I'll move further back, maybe. I don't actually know. Do you see people back here? Yes. Valkyrie still gets experience, Guardian still gets experience. Marauder does not get experience. One, two, three. Is anybody else not a master sergeant? Rubam, May. Okay, dead crystal pod. Marxist rifles have a very large damage range once you get up to alloy strike rifle, which makes in the zone chains a little, a little touchy sometimes. I think that was another chrysalid ping, and we've been hearing mutons as well. Ready to engage hostile targets. Definitely Chris Lipping that direction. Oh, hello. Hello. Uh <laughs> I thought we killed this twice already. That might be worth a shutter rocket. Well then. It's not going to be difficult to kill this. Going hot. Final shredder rocket. Shreds. Grenade? Grenade would be okay. Yeah, sure. Do I need to save this? I don't think so. Have another one of those somewhere. Can't really use it. Okay, so we have six chrysalids only. Got 22 hit points left. 10. Zero. You want a couple of kills on the Valkyrie. Good. I'm pretty sure none of this has mattered for a very long time. I'm like overanalyzing who should be taking which shots and it's just completely irrelevant. Maybe, well, 
We could put the Guardian on Overwatch this turn, but just giving Terrible Name some more experience is good too, I think. Alright, who's next? Let's do this. Weapons hot. We're green to go. There should be one more pod plus the command pod. I'm not sure there's allowed to be more enemies than that on the map, like in terms of Long War One didn't like having infinity enemies at once. We heard the command pod. It doesn't leave that many places that the other pod we're hearing could be. The other side of the command pod is obviously one or way off in this corner. I'm gonna sort of carefully move around the map a little bit with the mechs, see if we can get a clean audio cue on the Muton pod. Moving to designated position. Ass. Rubber's on the road and the kids are in the back seat. There are 37 down now. And Del Hood's on the ground. Yes, sir. Okay, so they are over this way. We've got something like four battle scanners left for two pods, one of which is stationary, so there's nothing wrong with using one of those here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Looks like just regular mutons. have four battle scanners affirmative rolling out I swear those guys have to be patrolling there now will do I like I'm Moving. certain that the game rules say that they Moving have to be patrolling top. right now I think they're just stuck in the corner yeah, I'm pretty sure they're just patrolling into a wall over and over again. Unless there's another pod. Um, okay, so I think that the marksman's rifle is stronger than the sniper rifle, just in general. But I, I also should, in fairness, point out how casually I move my soldiers around the map and the fact that that does make the sniper rifle somewhat more of a liability, given that my soldiers could literally be standing on any tile at any time. Battle scanners can mess them up sometimes. Hmm. Maybe that was it. Go loud. Go loud. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think that's eight, actually. That's eight. Yep. All right, then. Lock this door. Just 
gonna step here, take this free kill. And step back. Moving Over out. here. We know that there's nothing else on the map. Understood. Moving out. So we can make moves that look like they're Next suicidal, place. dashing into fog of war. And they're not actually risky at all. Approaching target now. Not hunker here. I don't love it. Affirmative. Moving out. Hold that a turn. Okay. Headed there now. Okay. Okay. Uh, where'd they all go? Over here, I guess. Scout. On my way. These guys do intimidate. I have a science fire? Got a science fire. So we can take this shot. Crit, please. Good. Just step back. Alright, that's like enough. We don't need any more of that than what we just got. Another six turns, and the pod will all be dead. Moving to position. Overwatch, aye aye. Okay. Cover this time. It all decide to go that way. Поехали. Сканер запущен. All right. Found ourselves a football team. actually go for a psychokinetic strike here. I guess this is like the only Running. situation where you want that ability. Over uh, just 40 defense. Super long grindy mission. Okay. Where you have to destroy lots of different cover. Step here with Gunfluster. He should be invisible. Cowardly mutons I've ever seen. Huh. Oh, they're running. They're running for a touchdown, huh? That makes about as much sense as any other explanation I can come up with. Position confirmed. Five mutants.
confirmed coordinates. Hmm. Archangel is not 100% safe. Letting mutants shoot at you. But I think Vandarn will be okay there in heavy cover. I was thinking about this move. You have... Ah, you've got some hit points. Let's see what happens. Special. Got it covered. Что за шум? They've changed their mind. That like two of them were going to stand anywhere near the enemy. Mutan Grenadier takes an opportunist reaction shot. 76% chance to hit. I'm pretty so-so on the decision to take this shot. I want the mission to be over though. Get some. And we have to kill all the bad guys for that to happen. Three mutons. Kill two mutons. On my way. Battle scanners up. Poor things. Poor things. One for all gives you another one point of damage reduction if you get shot at. And it also lets you provide cover to other soldiers who are next to you. But I'm just using it because it's a free action and it increases my damage reduction by one. It's it's not a very big deal. Okay, I don't know what was going on with those mutants. They did not want to fight me. But then it turned out that uh, they had to, and then they died. Rubbers on the road, and the kids are in the back seat. They do seem to be, well, they did seem to be running <laughs> toward vaguely where the command pod is. They weren't actually moving to it though. Like they came back. Rockets down and stuff. I don't know. Let's do this. I don't know. Double time it. All right, one command, On the one command pod left, and then we can go home. I'm on it, Commander. Reloaded. something out there aye aye commander looks 
Like we just get to set up right on the doors. I'm rolling. Right on the doors. Confirm coordinates. En route to target. I'm choose to that. Smoking my bacon. I'm on it. Yeah, I believe that all the doors are shut. Let's do this. So we get to surround these guys. Different color health bar. Um that's affirmative. I'm on it, Commander. Long War One mods. There's a mod called Hit Point Display Mod by Alatan. And you can find a link to it in the link that just came up in chat. Let's do this. You can customize what the colors yeah, are. So these are the ones that I picked, but Running. other people go for other ones. Let you know I'm a you overwatch. You hear that? These guys are not going to be alive for very long. Sir. Okay. Good copy. Moving on target. Overwatch. You are most welcome, Z, right? I'm on it, Commander. Welcome, welcome. Alright. Uh we could tile scan and work out exactly where the pod was. I'm blocking all the doors so that they can't get out on the target. to places where they do have cover. The result should be them all just standing next to each other and dying. Scanning. They're closest to you. Unless they're all the way over on that corner, in which case they just walk out here. Got something over here. Yeah, like that. Okay. Command pot of seven. Which is a lot. It's more like two, though, <laughs> after a couple of my soldiers have taken their actions. Let's go... Open this door. We grenade through there. Oh, we can. With Sapper? With Sapper. I just want to see what this grenade does before I shoot the shredder rocket. One of them is uncovered. Okay. This is a 100% chance to hit. So no scatter. Doesn't matter where it goes because he has tandem warheads. Going hot. This is gonna hurt. I think we need one more AoE. Should work. They won't last long. Hmm. Be another? Be 
Cool to hit two of those. Cool to hit one of them. Okay. Uncharacteristic oversight, huh? Drinks are on me. <laughs> Curses. <laughs> Curses. Um, Nothing's moving down there. Yeah, yeah, you don't think it matters this time, Paloward. Don't think it's gonna matter. Pretty sure we're okay. I don't know though. Anything could happen still. Got him. Aye, aye, Commander. Rebomb is actually getting experience here. Good. And dead. Fifty-two. It's a large number. Got some exhaustions, but no real wounds. Tech sergeant named Terrible has followed, and also is picking up vital point targeting. I think we go vital point targeting over lock and load. It's all. It's all a bit whatever. Me to mel, lots of stuff to sell. We're at 17 meld right now. Um. 138 alloys all of a sudden. Fragments are at 208. I'm targeting a sectoid commander. Plasma pistols would be cool to have. Probably get them eventually, right? Eh, whatever. What would my perfect training roulette soldier look like? Um, let's see. Okay, would probably upgrade lightning reflexes to something else. Hello targeting, ranger, vital point targeting, hit and run. I mean, pretty much this soldier, pretty much. The weird thing about, uh, the weird thing about training roulette is that you can just get the best soldiers imaginable just with regular trees. Training Roulette has never really seemed satisfying to me. It's interesting as a handicap on a campaign, I guess, but other than that, I don't know. Okay, third Archangel suit is done. So we've got three Archangels, two Titans, three mech suits everywhere. There's no reason to build any more armor. We can upgrade our mech suits. Grab a second tier two mech. Roster 
We're just going to cycle around a little bit. Weapons, Corporal, sure. We're going to end up with a lot of Corporals who have never been on a mission. Molly Daffy Brown. Sure, you're a soldier. All right. <laughs> um, Hollow Targer is built. Don't like the mobility mech suits? Not really. I value body shield very highly. And the hit points as well. And they're so fast already. I think that which suit you put the mech in is largely irrelevant in terms of what it does. Most of what a mech does is be able to utilize tiles without cover to uh, kill things safely. And either suit does that perfectly fine. Mech Findel. an extraction. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. Mm. <laughs> Let's randomize. These guys, scout, and, uh, not enough aim. Assault. Okay, you're fine. How far am I from exalt, base assault? Whenever I want to, basically. I'm just trying to farm a few more data recoveries for a little bit more meld. There's no, like, requirement that I do that. It's just sort of free. Urban block. Soldiers are not exactly loaded out, but they'll do fine. Strike one, prepare for landing. Scans indicate an exalt cell currently operating in Australia. We'll need to secure the area while our operative focuses on the exalt data. Brutal heart 